Yo, welcome to All Life Mans TV. I'm Jake's Anima, and this is your favorite channel. And if you are new to this channel, kindly subscribe. I will you subscribe, turn on the bell notification button. You know what that does? YouTube will use its algorithm to notify you whenever we drop a wonderful video. All right. Here we have a challenge recommended, by the way. Now, the question says 4 to the power of x minus 3 to the power of x equal to 7. x is equal to what? What would be the possible value or values of x? Let's take our solution. So you have your solution. We put down our question. So we have here 4 to the power of x minus 3 to the power of x equal to 7. Now, if we look at this question very well, yeah, let's divide through by 4 to the power of x. So from here, we now say divide, divide through, through by 4 to the power of x. So if we do that, we're going to have here 4 to the power of x all over 4 to the power of x minus 3 to the power of x all over 4 to the power of x equal to 7 to the 7 all over 4 to the power of x. Of course, this will give us 1 on this other side. Okay, so here we're going to have here 1 minus this expression is going to give us something special, which is 3 all over 4 all to the power of x. Because according to the law of indices, it says that if you have your a to the power of x all over b to the power of x, this can be expressed as a all over b all to the power of x. Okay, so if we apply that here, we're going to have this. Um, the right hand side will remain 7 all over 4 to the power of x. If we take a good look at this expression we have here now, there is no way we can take the natural log of both sides. What we look at here is to look at the, uh, the, the, the function we have here now, this function and this function. And if you watch carefully, this is going to give us a decreasing function. Okay, this is a decreasing function. And this is also a decreasing function. So we're going to have a kind of an intrinsic function from the uh, expression we have in here now. Okay? And so the only thing we can do here now is to send this to this other side of the equation. So this from here, let's proceed. This is going to give us 1 equal to 7 all over 4 to the power of x plus 3 all over 4 to the power of x. Okay, like I told you earlier on, if we introduce natural log to both sides, we still run into trouble here, okay? And like I said also, that this is going to give us a decreasing function, and this also will give us a decreasing function, because if we, if we plot the graph of this or this, then it's going to give us a decreasing function, which is going to tend to um, decrease down. Okay? So if we're going to have a decreasing function from this, the only way or the only um, procedure from here is to use um, the trial by error method, and which is also allowed in mathematics. Okay? So let's try the trial by error method. And mind you, from this function, x, x, our x, um, must be greater than zero. Okay, x will be greater than zero in this regard. Okay, so if x is greater than uh, zero, then let's try our uh, trial by error method. Then two we go into it. So if we use two, so all the only value that will satisfy this equation as it is now uh, is two. From here we now have the x to be um, x is equal to two. Uh, let's check if x equal to 2, we uh, satisfy the uh, equation. So check, check. We have to check our equation is 4 to the power of x minus 3 to the power of x equal to 
setting. Then from here, we say x is equal to 2. Okay, so when x equal to 2, we're going to have here 4 to the power of 2 minus 3 to the power of 2 equal to 7. And this will give us 16 minus 9 equal to 7. 16 minus 9 will give us 7 equal to 7. So 2 is the only root that will satisfy this um, exponential equation. Okay, so if you learn something from this uh, exponential equation, I drop it in the comment section. Or you have a better way of solving this. Okay, if you have a better way of solving this, also drop it in the co uh, comment section because we're here to uh, learn from you and even as you are there to learn from us in order for us to strike a win win situation, a balance. Okay, thanks for always being there. And also to the person that dropped this question, um, if you are not satisfied with the procedure, drop it in the comment section too okay uh, so that uh i can still rasak my uh, head to see if i can use a better procedure okay thanks for always be there and thanks to all my viewers for the confidence you have in me uh, those that are my subscribers too i'm much proud of you because you are always there for us bye for now